I've been dancing for about 13 years now. Almost 14, because I'm almost 16. I tried so many things growing up. Like I did soccer, I did piano, I did softball. I was playing soccer and I scored a goal for the other team. And then I was dancing down the field and my parents were like, maybe we'll stick to dance. And I was like, okay. I had a tough time with one of my dance teachers. She was pretty tough on me and I remember going through some hard stuff with her, but people started commenting about my eye on social media and it really got to me and it really affected like my self-confidence and my self-esteem. There was a time after I left the show Dance Moms, I kind of wanted to quit dancing. I was always told like, oh, you're not good enough as this person or you have to be better or you have to be perfect, you can't make mistakes. And that was really hard for me because nobody's perfect and everyone makes mistakes. I think once I left that negativity and I just found like a safe space to be myself and find that passion for dance again, that's when I really fell in love with it again because I felt, I felt like I could be myself and dance and that was enough. When people turn on music and I just start dancing, I think that's just a part of who I am, not even as a dancer, but just as a person. And I think that's what made it stick for me. It was just something I really loved. And oh, I just want to dance and get up and move and be able to like create. When it comes to dancing, it's like I forget about the haters and about what people have said about me and everything in that realm and I get to just be myself and dance and do what I love and forget about it.